almoço, prepara o jantar Prepara a cozinha, vamos começar Antônio e Ricardo esperando você E os convidados vem pra aprender Prepara o arroz, feijão, bacalhau Batata frita é paixão nacional Antônio e Ricardo servindo você Sopa de ervilha também você vai ter Vou preparar a delicinha Tô te esperando na cozinha The world. Sabor e qualidade é culinária do mundo inteiro. Vou preparar a delicinha. Tô te esperando na cozinha. Comigo vai aprender. Food of the world. Sabor e qualidade é culinária do mundo inteiro. Prepara o almoço, prepara o jantar, prepara a cozinha, vamos começar. O Tony Ricardo esperando você e os convidados vêm pra aprender. Hello, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are. Welcome with Ricardo Madares channel. Welcome. Okay, today I'm going to do a nice recipe. I'm going to make those delicious biscoff custard tartes. Lotus biscoff custard tartes. Look at that. That's what I'm going to make today. Please watch this recipe and learn and share with the rest of the world. Lotus biscoff Custard tart looks so yummy and delicious. Biscoff biscuit is done. There we go. Yes. That color. Wow, beautiful color. Okay, now let's melt the butter. Let's melt the butter. Yes, it's ready now. Okay, let's make a hole in the middle and let's mix it. Let's do this in here and let's combine everything together. Okay. And after we need to make the puff, the, the, the cupcakes, you know, in the cupcake shells, you're gonna do it, uh, turn this into a pastry. Okay. Yeah. And let's mix it properly. And I'm gonna make this into a tartlet, eh? Biscoff, Lotus Biscoff tartlet, eh? It's gonna be delicious, eh? Lotus Biscoff tartlet. And after we're gonna do a uh, uh, Lotus Biscoff uh, tartlet, but we're gonna turn into custard tarts as well, eh? Custard tarts, it's gonna be delicious and so yummy. Yeah, look like it's mixed properly. Yeah, make sure there is no lumps and mix it properly. Okay, I'm gonna turn the tartlet like that. I'm gonna show you how to do this. Yeah, okay, I've done one, I've been practicing. Now I'm gonna show you how I've done it. Okay, I'm gonna use one of those. Yeah, one of those. Okay, let's get the spoon right in the middle of the, the pastry. Just a little bit, and you're just gonna press it, press it down to make the underneath. Okay, so let's press it down nicely, and now put a bit more 
with your fingers you need to separate that yeah with your fingers okay you're gonna do this one here and i'm gonna do one with very close look yeah? and with your fingers just to keep pressing yeah until it come to the top eh? yeah if you need more mix just keep getting mixed and keep pressing until I get to the top eh? okay and after you keep pressing that to go down to make sure everything is just the same size and press it go all around eh? Yeah, look at that, looking good. Ah, look at that, we got two now, eh? Okay, let's hope it's close enough this one. Let's get another spoon right in the middle. Okay, and let's separate some in the sides. And uh, yeah, that's, not, that's how it started. Pushing the things to the side, pressing down and and pressing the other ones to the side. Eh? This is a good good way to mix. Eh? Here we go. Press down and let's add a bit more mix. Okay. Okay. Now it's the right the right amount. If you get the right amount, it'll be easy. Now we, we keep going around. Yeah, and keep pressing to the to up. Yeah, this is perfect. Eh? Okay, look at that. It's starting to look good. Yeah, all done here. Okay, now let's leave him in the fridge and let's make the delicious custard eh? to go in it. And after we're gonna bake in the oven. Eh? Look at that. Eh? It's nice looking good. Okay, now we're gonna make the syrup. Let's add the, the water. Yeah, water in there. And also, we're gonna add the cinnamon, cinnamon sticks, and the lemon. Okay, let it boil to give it flavor. Okay, and after we're gonna add the sugar to make the syrup. It's nearly boiling. Okay, it's boiling now, so let's remove the lemon and the cinnamon and let's add the sugar so we'll make the syrup. Okay, it's been removed, now let's add the sugar. Okay, and now 
as soon as the sugar is dissolved it will be like a syrup yeah? so dissolve all the sugar and this will be like the syrup to make this delicious uh, custard yeah? which is a Portuguese recipe yeah? yeah the custard is a Portuguese recipe yeah? but today we're making <coughs> a Bishkov uh, custard tart today yeah? so it will be a completely different recipe probably a new recipe invented by Mr. Ricardo with a touch of Portuguese <laughs> and a touch of uh, Biscoff Biscuit. So it's gonna be delicious, eh? Okay, so let's just turn it into a syrup. Here we go, look at that. A nice thick uh, cinnamon lemony syrup. Okay, so the syrup, it's almost done. Okay, it's boiling, so it's ready. Okay, let's leave it aside and let's go to the next step. Next step, let's add the corn flour here. Yeah, all the corn flour there. And just a little bit of the milk, yeah. A little bit of the milk and let's mix it with the fork, okay. And just set in the side, yeah. Leave it aside, yeah. Mix it properly. Now let's boil the milk. Let's boil the milk in a low heat. Yeah, a low heat. Okay, I put it in low heat now. And let's boil it. So it needs to boil it completely. Okay, now let's add it to the, the flour, the mix with the milk here. Okay. Now get that. And let's mix it until it cooks out. Yeah, but don't let, don't let it boil, eh? Don't let it boil. Okay, let's add the syrup inside. Yes, add the syrup. Yeah, the syrup is inside. And mix everything, yeah? Okay? Only two things missing in here. We got the vanilla and the egg yolk. So mix it. Yeah, very, very low heat until it cooks out. And now let's add a teaspoon of vanilla. Yeah, we need to add a teaspoon of vanilla. Oh. There's just one teaspoon of vanilla. This is a vanilla paste. I cannot go crazy. Yeah, okay. Yes, it's like a... Okay. Yes, a teaspoon of vanilla in here. Look at that. <laughs> and let's mix it until it cooks out properly. Yeah. Wow, amazing, yeah? And now we're gonna add the egg yolk and mix it very, very fast, eh? Very fast so it doesn't cook out in here. Here we go, like that, very fast. Yeah, here we go, eh? Like this, look at that color. Mm? Look at that beautiful color. Beautiful, look at that. Look at this color with the eggs, eh? beautiful color. Wow, amazing. Let's cook out a little bit and after take it out and fill up the the, uh, the shells, eh? the pastry shells. Okay, now let's put the, the some of the custard in here. And fill up the tartlets. Eh? Okay, you need to fill up the tartlets. Okay, let's don't fill it too much because it might not be enough. Just like that. Okay, just keep it that way. Maybe like that. Should be nice and delicious. Now we're gonna cook in the oven for about 25 minutes, and it's gonna be delicious and yummy. Gonna sprinkle some icing sugar as well on top. Yeah, sprinkle some icing sugar and a bit of cinnamon. Yeah, look at that. Looking good. Ready to go in the oven. Okay, before it goes in the oven, let's sprinkle some uh, icing sugar. Just a little bit of icing sugar like that. 
that is gonna help to give a nice caramel caramelized topping nice caramelized topping yeah size okay and also I just sprinkle a little bit of cinnamon as well just a little bit you don't too much of cinnamon okay and it's ready to go in the oven now it's ready to go in the oven for about 25 minutes it's delicious Biscoff Casa Tart. Okay, now it goes in the oven. Here we go, look at them. They look so delicious. Look at that. Looking good and delicious. Eh? So happy with the result. Eh? Wow, amazing, amazing. Now they need to cool down, and after we're gonna take them out of the the pastry cases and they're gonna look pretty and tasty but they need to cool down eh? delicious and yummy look at them eh? they look so beautiful every single one looks so delicious and yummy eh? look at that so pleased with them now let's take them out and present them and let's try one as well to see this delicious recipe eh? Okay, let's take one out. Be gentle. Open like that. Look at that, look so good. Look at that, they all came out. Look at that, looks delicious and yummy. They all come out of the, the pastry, of cake pastry, and looks so yummy and delicious. Eh? Look at that tree here by itself there. Look at that, eh? yummy and delicious. Eh? A real treat. Eh? Okay, I hope you like this video. It's not uh, difficult to make. Please uh, like, subscribe, and share with the rest of the world so people learn and taste this delicious uh, tart. You know, so delicious and yummy. Lotus biscoff custard tart. Eh? Lotus biscoff tart tart. A real treat. Eh? Okay, people. I hope you enjoy my recipe. Lotus Biscoff Custard Tart it looks yummy and delicious. Please subscribe, like, and share with the rest of the world because this is a unique recipe. I believe it's done by me. <laughs> I don't think anybody ever tried this recipe done this way. So let's try it and give it a try and tell me what you think. Eh? Leave a comment. And subscribe and like and share with the rest of the world. You will be helping Ricardo Madarin's channel. And I really, really appreciate. Thanks for watching. They look beautiful. Mmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah, me, huh? Mmm. You like it? Very nice. Look at that inside. Looks so yummy.
Look at that, looks so yummy. Very yummy and delicious, eh? Mm -hmm. A real treat. Prepara o almoço, prepara o jantar Prepara a cozinha, vamos começar A Tony e Ricardo esperando você E os convidados vem pra aprender Prepara o arroz, feijão, bacalhau Batata frita, paixão nacional A Tony e Ricardo servindo você Sopa de ervilha também você vai ter Vou preparar a delicinha Tô te esperando na cozinha Comigo vai aprender Foods of the world Sabor e qualidade é culinária do mundo inteiro Vou preparar a delicinha Tô te esperando na cozinha Comigo vai aprender Foods of the world Sabor e qualidade é culinária do mundo inteiro Prepara o almoço, prepara o jantar Prepara a cozinha, vamos começar Antônio e Ricardo esperando você E os convidados vêm pra aprender